Is air conditioning making cities hotter? As Europe faces more frequent and more intense heat waves, you might have considered taking the plunge and buying an air conditioning unit. And while you might think it's cooling things down, it's actually doing the exact opposite. It's heating things up. Let's find out why. In France, the environmental impact of the use of AC has become a topic of debate lately, particularly when left-wing MP Mathilde Panot mentioned that the temperature of a city can be increased by up to 2 degrees Celsius due to the use of AC. But where does she get this number from? It comes from a study published in 2020 that bases itself on a scenario in which air conditioners are used in all buildings of a city like Paris to maintain an interior temperature of 23 degrees Celsius during a heat wave. Temperature increases due to AC use depend on the time of day and the characteristics of the heat wave, mainly its intensity according to the study. The scientists used the deadly 2003 heat wave which killed more than 14,000 people in France to model their predictions. They found that after nine days of a heat wave similar to the one of 2003, the systematic use of AC during that time would increase air temperature by up to 2.4 degrees Celsius. So how is that possible? Well, it's because air conditioners work like a heat pump, cooling a room by releasing hot air outside. Air conditioners use more electricity than any other appliance in the home. They consume 10% of global electricity and leak harmful planet warming gases into the atmosphere. And as cities are only likely to grow hotter as a result of climate change and increased development, that means that humans will demand more indoor cooling. In 2019, 20% of EU households owned an AC unit according to the European Environment Agency. The number of air conditioners worldwide is predicted to soar from 1.6 billion units today to 5.6 billion units by the middle of the century, according to a 2019 report issued by the International Energy Agency. If left unchecked, by 2050, all the air conditioners in the world would use as much electricity as China does for all of its activities today. The scientists behind the study give other options to help cool down cities, including creating more green spaces and better insulating buildings. For more fact checks and investigations, check out our website, euronews.com.